Hello, everybody, and good day to you all today. I'm talking about Luke Cage episode number six. Suckers need bodyguards. In this episode here, we have Luke Cage. He's teaming up with um, Claire Temple, played by Rosario Dawson. Because they have to protect Detective Raphael Scarf. Scarf is the dirty cop. And he tried to make, he was making a deal with, um, with Cotton Mouth. And he tried to betray Cotton Mouth. And Cotton Mouth got pissed off and he shot him. With his own gun. That's really messed up. So he has nowhere else to go. He can't, he can't go to the police. Because all people on the police force are corrupted by Cotton Mouth as well. And so he doesn't, he doesn't want them to find out. He, he, he doesn't want to go to the hospital. Because well... And they go to the hospital, they know, they know where he is, and he might get killed, get killed there. So he, so he goes to the one person who he believes can't, who can't protect him, Luke Cage. And Luke Cage will nothing to do with him. But, because he has something that Luke Cage wants to take down Cottonmouth, he, Luke, Luke Cage helps him out. Now, while that's going on, you have Mr. Knight, and she has a new partner now, Lieutenant Perez, played by um, Manny Perez. And so... Their job is to try to find um, Scarf before the other anybody else does and bring him back into justice. Trying to save his life and to find out the, the real truth if he actually is corrupt or not. And while that's going on, you have, you have Mar um, Mar Mariah, the councilwoman, who's getting, who's getting interviewed because she wants to betray to the, to the world that she's some good guy saint who's trying to save Harlem from the corruption and she's going to be the one to save it. Turns out, well... We already knew this already, but now that now everybody else is going to figure it out too, that she's not so on the side of the angels. She's not at all. No, 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 no. She has a lot of bad connections. And Cottonmouth looks like he's about to go down. Looks like his little reign of crime is start to end. Is it going to be over yet? I don't know for sure, but that's how it looks. Now, this was another great episode. I really did enjoy it a whole lot. Not a lot of action happened in, in this episode here. A little slower pace. Nothing wrong with that. I actually do enjoy that sometimes. Sometimes it's just good to just slow things down, just understand where things are going. Some people are not like that. It's not. It's not. It's, this 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 series right here is not gonna be action packed like Daredevil was. It's not like it's not like that. Because see, Daredevil, I was the guy who wanted to be the hero and went out there and actually went after the bad guys. This here's here. This is a guy who didn't want to be noticed. He didn't want to really want to be the hero, but but because of circumstances, he is forced to go on this journey, and you're, so you're watching him become the hero. See, Daredevil, he was already the hero. Luke Cage, he's becoming the hero. So it had, it had, a, it had a different tone, a different pacing than, than, the, um, than the other shows. And I, and, I, and I still am enjoying that a whole lot. Um, I enjoy the characters on the show, the acting on, on the show, I, I'm enjoying. I like, the, I like the chemistry between um, Luke Cage and Claire, how they're meeting, how they fit, uh, um, how they're meeting and interact with one another. And there was a, a moment in there where I thought it was going to go in a different direction. But Claire stopped that right off the bat. And I thought that was kind of fun. I, actually, I really did enjoy that a whole lot. So overall, another great episode. I really am enjoying this show a whole lot. I'm, I'm enjoying everything about it from the music to how it looked, how it shot, the, the, feel of the, how, the feel of it. I'm enjoying it and I love it. I like the special effects on the show because it's not really over the top in your face. But, it, but it's, for, for what it is, it's done quite well. From every, from every bullet that gets shot, every time you lift something up or every time you, when he stops a, a truck or something like that, it's believable. And I really do enjoy that. So, another great episode for me. But don't take my word for it. So check it out for yourself. Hopefully when you watch it, you will enjoy it and you will love it and have fun watching it too. Because I'm having fun watching this series. So leave your comments down below. Let me know what you thought about this episode of Luke Cage. And if, like I said before, if you haven't been watching it, so check it out for yourself. Well, that's all I got to say about that. So give my channel a big like and thumbs up. Mm, boop. And subscribe to my channel and share. I really would appreciate it. Like I always say in my dreams in real life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. A peace out of peoples.